Welcome once again to West Vibe G8 on YouTube. Yes, it is another beautiful day, right? An update on the Cookathon happening live at the Modern City Hotel in Tamale. Yes, it is day 8 of the Cookathon happening in Modern City a hotel in Tamale. Yes, Fayala Abdul Razak is doing incredibly well. She's doing massively well when it comes to the cooking marathon. It's like the girl, she's not getting tired. The lady is not getting tired day in, day out. Yes. Anyway, if this is your first time of visiting the channel, before we get into it, we pleading with you to hit on that post notification you see on the screen and also subscribe to this channel. That's S Vibes GH right here on YouTube and join the family of S Vibes GH on YouTube. Yes. So last week we saw a whole lot of dignitaries trooping into the modern sitting hotel in Tamale just to support our sister Fire Lab Raza who intends breaking the Guinness World Record. Yes, so initial plan was to do 120 hours that's to break that record of the Irish chef that's fishes record of 19 119 hours so she intends doing 120 hours yes but uh, per the rumors circulating online that oh there is one chef also who did 144 hours who is yet to be which is yet to be approved by the guinness world record so her team decided that yes indeed they are no longer going to do the um 120 hours they intend to intend doing this for five days right but then that's going to a level where she wants to make things tough for people that may think of coming on board to break this record again. So the initial plan was they are going to do 200 solid hours to make it difficult for anybody that is going to come online or to come on board to break this record again. But what happens next? A whole lot of things are happening and the reports coming forth indicates that Charlie, this time around, yeah, almost they are not going to do that um, 200 hours again. They are going to do extension to... 240 hours my goodness 240 hours Charlie the lady she gets strength she's very strong she gets strength because to be standing and cooking for eight consecutive days because today is the day eight of the cooking uh, marathon which is being held in Tamale so this is from Ghana website so uh, I'm just going to read some portions of it he said according to Joy News Fire Light who is seeking to clock a total of 240 hours so Mr. Dambana um, that's manager of Fire Light to Abdul Razak in an interview with the Ghana news agency. Tamale said the idea is no longer five days. We are doing six to seven days, but now they are doing the eight, which is um, eight days. And so far, they've done 180 hours so far. And she intends doing 240 hours to make it very difficult for anybody that is going to come on board to break this Guinness World Record. Charlie, it is just so marvelous, so surprising to see this lady standing on their feet for this number of days. Yes. It is not just that the dignitaries that trooped in our very own that's the vice president of the republic of ghana uh, also uh, stormed there yes so dr mahmoud baumia was also there uh, he went there not just there he didn't go empty handed he just not go stand there to cheer the lady up but then he has been able to give out thirty thousand ghana cities to you know be used in supporting fire lab the razak so that was what he offered thirty thousand ghana cities in support of what she's doing that's to break the guinness world record yes aside from that our very own our own mother as well too that's the former first lady of the republic of ghana her excellency lordina mahama also stormed the yard and she also went there to chair up the lady so that she will be able to break that particular record the funniest aspect of it all was when these look alike people too they also stormed there ah now nah, i did yeah yeah a month for coin you see the green trees corner see for another they look alike people too they carry them a concert they go there ah as they go there too they no go keep quiet too they stood outside the modern city hotel they were taking pictures videos and they were using it to teach people online charlie if like I don't go to Tamale before, before this West go do this thing, like go bash me. But lucky enough, I've been to Tamale before, I've been to Bonin City Hotel before. So when I saw the initial video, I was like, ah, this is what they are just coming online again to tease people. So I also stormed there. They also decided to be teasing people with their, you know, look alike something. They just said, them a whole concept, you know, then start carry go the premises of the cookathon. Well, they did well by going there to entertain the fans there, yeah. So uh, some people also got the privilege of seeing there because I said, like, more yard than celebrities, kaka kaka. Yeah, because some few, um, I think some few months back or some few days back, medical gave them the platform to join him on stage to you know, perform. So gradually, gradually, a look at like something is becoming official in the country. Yeah, so that's the gist so far concerning the cookathon happening in Tamale in the northern part of Ghana. Paela Abdul Razak now intends breaking the record and she intends extending the days to. Um, she she intended extending the hours to 240 hours instead of the 200 hours she initially.
initial limit measure. It started from 120. From 120, they went to 200. And now they say they are going to do 240 hours. We pray that she will not go and sleep and or wake up again and tell her that she wants to do 500 hours. The furniture, we need her alive. So uh, that's it so far. So good concerning the cookathon. So if this is your first time, once again, don't forget to subscribe. Once, once you subscribe, kindly leave your comment also in the comment section. And also share this video with others too yes so until that we pray the universe give you a better treat peace